at Samurai Fight Championships with the victorious Steph Evans, main event, and now PFL signed Steph Evans. Yeah. How are you feeling after the win? Uh, do you know, I'm over the moon. Um, I've put a lot on the line to um, fight this year. Um, I've taken a sabbatical from work, which meant no pay. Um, and I've, I've risked a lot um, in my life to be able to do this. And it's, it's paying off, so I'm, I'm over the moon. Yeah, and you had a, a great reception tonight. Come out, obviously, for a tough girl. Yeah, can you, yeah. Can you talk us through the fight a little bit? Obviously, she seemed to be doing okay on the feet starting off, but yeah. then ultimately you got her to the floor Do and, you know, we and knew, finished it. I knew she was going to be, she was a kickboxer. Um, she's fought professionally kickboxing. Um, she was a world champion, I think. Um, so <coughs> she has gone straight on to PFL as a pro for a pro debut um, in MMA. She lost her pro debut, so this was sort of her chance to get back on. So I knew she was going to come out um, with a bit of venom because this is, you know, her sort of last chance soon to make a thing of it in MMA. So um, yeah, she she hit like a train. <laughs> that, that was the first um, left the first exchange. She hit me with her left hook, right hand, and, and my face up went wow, wow, and I thought, oh my god. <laughs> Um, but I knew ultimately that like, I was going to be better in the wrestle and better in the grapple. Um, but obviously the height difference made it made it daunting for me to shoot. I had to shoot so low. But um, I, I knew once I got hold of it, that was going to be sort of the end of it. Yeah. yeah. A big win. Obviously now you've got that contract at PFL. Yeah. How much does that mean to you to be going, you know, to a, a, a such a big fight promotion essentially? Um, do you know this is a dream come true for me? Um, so next year uh, we're going to get our head really focused, um, I'm going to win the tournament um, and go into the American PFL and fight for the million dollars, that's, that's the plan, that's the dream and, um, and I'm not going to stop until I get there. Yeah, brilliant. Yeah. And just lastly then, what what's it been like for you in this camp, obviously you, you said you know, you've know you moved up to Albert Leary, yeah. you, you're in show MMA, what's it been like preparing for this with, with so many killers around you? Um, I've been in a show MMA now for probably two, two and a half, three years maybe. Um, so it, it, it's been it's been fantastic from from the get go. But I've really seen a difference since I took a sabbatical from from work in January. Um, obviously, uh, I've had such consistency in my training, and then moving up here as well in the last six months has meant that I can train consistently three times a day um, with such high level athletes. It's, um, you know, it, my skill set has gone on so much, not to mention like my gas tank um, and my resilience as well. You know, being um, <laughs> wrestling with Brett for, for three rounds, it, it makes you a bit resilient, you know? <laughs> yeah. well, brilliant. Well, Seth, congratulations on the win tonight and uh, can't wait to see you fighting in the PFL next. Thank you. Well Thank done. you so much. Thanks.